Hello, today we've got another new art tutorial for you. This time it's about the European squirrel, mainly because I really think their fur, like the color of the fur, suit really well with autumn. And also because they're adorable. So yeah, I decided to paint some on my nails this week. I'm um, so gonna start out with sort of a darkened nude shade, which is Vacation Time by Sinful Colors. Which really is a very nice nail polish in terms of quality, but I do think the color is, I don't know, quite dirty looking. But it's perfect for autumn. As you can see this nail polish covers pretty much in one layer. But just to strengthen the nail a little bit I am going to apply a second layer. I want sort of a forest like background so I'm also going to add some green. Uh, this is Rush and Shine by Simple Colors. According to the bottle it is a matte nail polish but... It's actually shiny, so I don't know what's up with that. But I'm just going to put a little bit of that on a sponge. Or, you know, like the raw part or the more rough part of a sponge. And then just dab it onto my nail. You could also try it with a dotting tool or something, but... The idea is to get it to look sloppy and it's just easier to make it look sloppy with a sponge. And then it looks like this. Okay, I'm gonna make an, a European squirrel, but because I don't really have the right color, it's sort of a golden brown shade. Um, I'm going to use Stored by Rimmel instead, which is sort of a shimmery reddish brown. It's, you know, slightly more pure purplish red than a um, squirrel will be, but oh well. Um, you can use a detail brush for this, or a striper brush, or whatever you prefer. I'm using a uh, striper brush simply because it usually works better for me. And I'm just going to make a sort of simple... Scroll. I'm not going to make this too difficult, mainly because I really can't paint scrolls for some reason. So yeah, the trick then is to just take your time and keep it simple. Just really make the basic shapes of it. And with the scroll, really the most important part is really the tail. So as long as you do that right, the rest of it will be fine. And also, as you can see, I'm just starting on the outline because that is usually the easiest, for me at least. Well, it's easy to start with it, but I always start with the most difficult parts. So, yeah. And then just a hind leg here. And then there's the outline of the scroll. And then all there's left to do is coloring in the outlines. Which is a lot easier than making the original outlines of course. And you can always fix some details while coloring it in. So I'm just gonna make the ear a little bit better shape here. And then just fill it in. And then it's time to give the scroll a face. I'm going to start out with this uh, white nail polish by Max. Any white nail polish will do basically. You only need a little tiny amount. I'm using the striper brush again by the way. And I'm just using that to create the white part of the eye. And you could just make a black eye uh, if you want to make it easier for yourself. But with a dark color as this in the background you're not really going to see the black all that good. So I'm starting out with white instead. And then I'm using this black nail polish by uh, Playboy. And while the white of the eye is going to dry, I'm just going to very, very carefully paint a little mouth on the squirrel. And a little nose. And as you can see the Black doesn't really stand out all that much. And then I'm just going to add a pupil to the eye to make it uh, somewhat less creepy. And then the scroll looks like this. And then once the faces are dry, I'm going to use top coats. I'm using the Essence Studio nails better than gel nails as usual. And I'm just applying a good thick layer of it. So 
So this is the finished look. Um, this scroll actually came out looking better than this one. This one looks slightly deformed, I have to admit. But yeah. Still, I hope you enjoyed watching this. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Bye! Rain is also an important part of autumn, unfortunately. Um, so I also wanted to use blue and I'm going to use I Don't Need Money Honey by Essence.